my name's Cheryl. I work for Living Well and Link for Life in the Healthy Lifestyles Nutrition Team. What we're going to be doing today is cooking the easiest chilli ever and I've raided my um, store cupboard of ingredients. So we've got here lots of tinned products and we're going to make a bean chilli. So I've got chopped tomatoes, sweet corn, I'm going to use mixed beans, kidney beans, but if you've got some mixed bean salad in or whole white kidney beans, any kind of beans at all, that's what we're going to do. So what I've done here, I've sautéed some um, red onion off, but you can use any kind of onion, whatever you've got in your store cupboards. These are locked down easy recipes. So I've used a tiny little bit of olive oil. Olive oil is a good fat. So we want to be using that and then I'm going to put in, these are really useful if you want to get some of these in your shopping because um, I know that we can't go as often as we'd like but we need to have things in where we can make things really flavoursome. So I'm just going to put some chilli in if you like it hot or spicy or loads of flavour put more in or put less in. So. That is, that. and then I've got, um, I'm going to put sweet corn in and these mixed beans. So I've, that's my kidney beans and lots of different kinds. Beans are really good because they give us lots of fibre. They're a good source of protein. And actually three tablespoons of beans counts towards one of your five a day. So my beans are going in there with the garlic and onion. Some mixed herbs again all really good store cupboard ingredients they're gonna go in pack in some nice flavor I've got a tin of tomatoes that I've already got some herbs in so all these are really cheap economical things to have in your cupboard so we're actually making the whole meal out of store cupboard ingredients so I'm just gonna add that give it a good stir this is like a two minute chili you could do it in your microwave, put it in a microwavable dish and um, pop it on till it's warm through. Everything's warm through. What you do need to make sure you do though is drain everything and rinse them off. Um, not the tomatoes, obviously they're in tomato sauce, but beans, things like this, you need to drain them off. Um, make sure you choose, tin products are actually really good, but make sure you choose them in water. These are mixed beans in water not brine because that contains extra salt. We're not going to be putting any salt in this today. It's one of our lockdown healthy nutritious meals. So I'm going to put my sweet corn in and remember this is a chilli so we're going to put some chilli powder in. Again if you want to just put a tiny bit in just put a few little sprinkles in. Children might not really like it very hot and chilli can be a little bit hot. But just do that again to taste, about a teaspoon, I've just put half in, I'm going to make it a little bit more spicy. You do whatever is right for you and for your family. If you want to make it mild firstly, just um, put a little bit in and then serve out for the people that only like it mild and then add a bit of extra chilli for yourself. So this is just all warming through. So I've got my mixed herbs in, I've got my garlic in, I'm going to put a little bit of pepper. Again, the more flavour we can get, the better. So all you need to do, because we've already cooked our onions, is make sure that everything is really warm through. You could add anything you want in this. You could add a tin of baked beans if you wanted. And don't forget, you don't need to have meat every meal. So that's coming to a nice temperature. Maybe bring it to a simmer, so that means when there's little bubbles going in it. Because I've already cooked the onion, the beans are already cooked and they just need warming through. So this is going to be a really cheap, tasty dish. You could serve it with some rice and um, the packet rices that you get are really good. That It just take two minutes, particularly in lockdown, because um, we can store them for a long time. Or just boil yourself some rice. Or you could serve it with some crusty bread or some even some potato wedges and we will do potato wedges another time so i'm going to just add a little bit more garlic felt like it was a little bit stingy so 
this is coming to a nice temperature now. Just get it hot enough to serve. Remember that everything's already cooked. We've drained them off. So we've got onions, tomatoes and our beans. So we've got plenty of our five a day in there. Probably about three portions. So a really good way to get your five a day. So I'm just going to finish this off to make it really appetising. So I'm just going to pop some into my dish. If you were having rice, you could put your rice in there. This will serve four people. And then I've got some natural Greek yogurt that I'm just going to pop on the top to finish it off. Some people use sour cream, but I'm just going to use natural low fat Greek yogurt. Just whatever you've got in. And then I love my parsley in these little jars. They're probably only about 50p, even less, about 39p. And I'm just going to finish off with a little bit of parsley on the top. And there is the easiest bean chilli that you'll ever be able to make. Enjoy. See you next time and stay safe.